it's disappointing because you know you want to be out there, but uh, you know you gotta. I guess I just gotta listen to my body. You know, I'm not quite there yet. Evaluating where he was or is right now, uh, as compared to the players that we have out there, um, didn't feel it was the best move for us. That's the word from cornerback Kyle Fuller and John Fox after the news that Fuller will be placed back on injured reserve. What began as a supposed simple knee scope now costs him the entire season and seemingly the player and the team are not exactly on the same page. You know there's three stages to getting back to the field. One is you got to get medical clearance. Two, the player's got to say he's ready to go and feels confident and he's chomping at the bit to go play. And then the coaches get involved. A has happened, B hasn't, so C is a non-issue. Yeah, that's definitely not true. You know, I think I've, you know, been communicating with, uh, you know, the, the, the team and, you know, just let them know how much I want to be back. I mean, that's a fine line, uh, you know, to go through. I mean, you want to be tough, but you don't want to, you don't want to be stupid. So Fuller won't be able to return to help the Bears Sunday against a tough Washington offense. And meanwhile, Alshon Jeffrey and Pernell McPhee say they won't be satisfied with just another game where the Bears play hard but lose. I ain't never happy with a loss. I'm very disappointed with the losing. Well, I can't say disappointed because we, we, we have played, but I'm not happy. You just got to go out and c compete and just respond. And everybody want to go out there and put together a good game, and uh, hopefully we come out with a win. With the Bears, I'm Evan Fitzgerald, Fox 32 Sports.